All right, so four podcasts that changed my life. In no particular order, we have The Roommates, The Millionaire Morning Show by Anton Daniels, Earn Your Leisure, and The Table by Anthony O'Neill. Let's talk about it. Check the mic and make sure it sounds right, boy. sound right boy what's up y'all and welcome back to the richest steve in atlanta today i'm giving y'all the top five podcasts that changed my life i figured i'd come to y'all today and give y'all some of the podcasts that i've been watching because i know a lot of the podcasts out here aren't adding no value to our lives except for some entertainment factor the podcast that i picked out only four of them, they have been very good to me and have been helping me on my journey to becoming a better man and becoming debt free. So I hope they can do the same for you. All right, starting with The Roommates. This podcast is hosted by Chris and Hafiz, and they are all about setting the standard. They're able to accomplish this by hosting interviews all about leveling up your thinking and your character. The roommates have been able to add value because they have cultivated a whole community of roommates or guests like Dr. Jordan Peterson, Robert Green, or Stefan Speaks. These roommates are then able to share each of their unique stories and we are able to get those valuable lessons and use them in our everyday lives. I've personally been watching the roommates for a little bit over a year now and it's honestly the longest, most constant podcast that I've been watching. I'm not surprised though, because this is truly my favorite podcast. Uh, just the interactions are just so authentic between the roommates and they provide a lot of different perspectives from different many walks of life. And I don't see that in most podcasts today. I would recommend this podcast to anyone who's leveling up your life, developing your character and just enjoy a great conversation. Now on to the Millionaire Morning Show with Anton Daniels. This podcast is all about the mindset of a millionaire and the money reason for why millionaires do what they do. Also, while I'm saying it's a podcast, this is really a talk show that you can catch every morning, bringing you hot topics on money and character development. I say this talk show is about the mindset of a millionaire and the money reasons why millionaires do what they do because Anton Daniels is an actual millionaire. All he's doing is sharing his everyday thoughts and how he was able to grow his money and most importantly, keep his money. I've been listening to the Millionaire Morning Show for over a year now. And while I'm not able to catch it every day, I do watch it whenever I can. Plus, he's always dropping nuggets on how the rich are able to use taxes and businesses to grow their wealth. I would say out of all the podcasts on this list, this show has provided me the most financial wise. I say this because I was recommended the first two books that I read this year, The Richest Man in Babylon and The Alchemist, which were both two great reads. Then The Patreon is a1 is probably the most value that you'll get get the patreon it provides masterminds and step-by-step -step instructions on what you need to do to structure your life for success and the icing on the cake is i decided to get mentorship from anton and i got all the value out of it that i needed 
I would recommend this podcast to anyone who wants to be a millionaire. Tap in, get in that Patreon, join the bag chasers. Next, we have Earn Your Leisure. This podcast is all about assets over liabilities. And when I say all about, they created a whole university teaching people how to gain assets. They also interview different people on how they gain their wealth. This podcast is hosted just like a university. They have classes on credit, stocks, entrepreneurship, real estate, and more. The thing is, they just don't skim the surface though. They break each subject down specifically for whoever they're interviewing during that class. For example, with real estate, they just don't give it to you in broad terms. They break it down into making millions off of multifamily homes, making a fortune in Airbnb, getting started in wholesale, it all just depends on how whoever they're interviewing specifically made their wealth. Now, I've known about Earn Your Leisure the longest out of all these podcasts, but when I first started watching them, I just couldn't couldn't keep with it. This is because the way the podcast is set up, it's just such a flood of information. Everything was going right over my head, so I just wasn't ready. I would recommend this podcast because overall they create great content and they are providing so much wisdom to the community. I would just advise that you have something specifically that you're looking for. That way you won't get lost in everything that they have to offer. And finally, we have The Table with Anthony O'Neill. This podcast is all about becoming debt free and stewarding your single season for before you get married. Anthony O'Neill comes from the Dave Ramsey team. So he focused heavily on getting out of debt and also gaining your wealth without using debt. Another thing he focuses heavily on is single people and helping us cultivate our finances and goals for before we have a family. He does both of these by hosting lessons on debt and also dating with a purpose. Also, he loves to bring other people onto his platform to share their testimonies on how they were able to become debt-free and build their families. Out of all the podcasts, The Table is the one that I've been watching for the shortest amount of time, for about half a year now. But he has really been helping me by encouraging me and inspiring me to stay on my debt-free journey. I would recommend this podcast to anyone who wants to be debt free or if you're trying to navigate this world while maximizing your single season. To end this off, if you made it this far, make sure you like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Also, make sure that you're going to check out these podcasts. That way you can form your own opinion and you never know. They might change your life too. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you for tuning in. Peace, love, and riches. I'm out.